Yeah. BB, you know the you know the anatomy of a rifle, right? Yeah. Okay. I don't know what this is called, but this is where you aim it. This is what you use to aim at the target. Okay? You want the target to sit right above it or in the middle, depending on your distance from the target. You want to pull it down, but this was the, the this you see the you see the tip up right here? You see that tip right there? You have to see the tip through this I forgot what that's called. That piece right there. And so when you when they line up like like so, and they, you see that piece looks like like this, it's, it's, uh, it's like this. Let's, let's consider that this and this piece here. Let's consider it this. Yeah. Okay. So what you want to do is get them in the middle like that. Put yeah. that in between it. We're not like like not when it's like this. Not when it's like that, but it's like straight up. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And the target just tip point here. The target you want to be this is the bullseye, right? Mm -hmm. When you're closer, you want the bullseye to sit in the middle. Like, on, in the middle of that. This is in the middle of the bullseye, show up there. But when you get to certain distances, you want to bring it down some to where the bullseye sits in the cover, like that. Yeah. Right. So, <clears throat> all I'm going to do is I'm going to crack it one time, but your placement and your body posture is important. You want, you want this to sit in the pocket of your chest. What do I have to do with my feet? I mean, this, it's, 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 it's sort of like the part of sitting on that's comfortable for you, right? So the part is, is, is better, but um, you want just to sit in the pocket of your, of your shoulder. And then you want to have your arm, your arm acts as a, um, a leg, so to speak. Okay. And your ribs, and uh, so you know, show your elbow against your ribs like this, it sits like that, right? Mm -hmm. And and then your hand, and then you allow this just rest in your hand. Don't grip it like that. You just allow it to. The hand is just a placement. You understand? Mm -hmm. And then when you uh, when you got to sit in your shoulder like that, you rest, you rest it on your you rest it on your hand, like so, not grabbing. And then you just line up the target, like so, right? Yeah. You allow your cheek to just fall gently on it, rest on like your cheek. It helps to stabilize, it does not stabilize the weapon. Like this, right? And then it also allows you to get a good grip. You know? And then there's three different things. There's the an there's well maybe four different things. There's the anatomy of the rifle you have to familiarize yourself with. And a lot to be able to line it up with the target for accuracy. Then what also helps accuracy is the way it fits in your shoulder so that it does not move. And once you got it lined up, you don't want it moving around. And then you got your um your leg or your placement with this hand here. Sometimes you might have to lift up your hip just to get it, depending on where the target is, right? And then also, too, your cheek keeps this in place, because I swear if it moves like that, it's going that way. You know, it's like that, it goes that way. And also, too, your breathing. So the third thing it's is... Not hurt my cheek. The third thing is... I wouldn't tell you that if it would hurt your cheek. The third thing is breathing. None of this will hurt. This is... I'm just trying to teach you marksmanship. Um, uh, let me see. The other thing is breathing. Once you get your target lined up, to get your target lined up, you want to take a deep breath and then relax. And make sure the target's lined up and then hold your breath. Do not breathe again until you pull that trigger. And once you pull the trigger, now this is the fourth thing, the trigger. You don't want to be getting your finger all the way in there like this. You don't want to be bam, bam, because that will jerk it to the left or to the right. Depending on what finger you use. If I do it like that, it's going to jerk it to the right. You want that um, you want to squeeze the trigger. You want to squeeze the trigger with just the tip of your finger, and you want to just pull it back. You don't want to. You don't want to really get in there like that. Let me see if I can pull this. Okay, I can't. Let me take it off safety. Okay, now it's off safety. I want to give you an example. You clever point it that way so it don't come back down on us. You want to do it like, like that. You know what I'm saying? Not like that. Not like you know. Just like gently pull. Make sure you keep your form. But make sure you don't pull the form off. All right, so I'm going for. Let me see if I can cock one. All right, because that one was empty as soon as. Was that right there? Yeah. And I was aiming for right here, so something was off. And by the t and, and by the way you hit the, by the way you hit the target. You can tell what you did wrong, because if I was aiming for this and I hit down this, that means I either squeezed too, um, I squeezed too hard, didn't squeeze gently enough, or uh, my breathing was off, and I did something to, like, lower it 
and or my stance was off. I did something to lower it so that it didn't hit the target. But that tells you where you hit the target tells you what you need to improve on to make the, um, to make the correction so that you get the target. So when I'm far back there, I aim right there below the target. When you when you the, the, from the distance we are, mm -hmm. and that's my problem too. I aimed I aimed right here mm -hmm. instead of right. There. I want this. Okay. Here's here's this part right here. Here's this piece. The tip of the the tip of the rifle. This is the tip of my finger, right? All ashy and shit, but it goes in the middle like that. It goes in. It goes in the middle. Uh -huh. I got it. I got it. Be careful. Right. I'm gonna try for it again. So I got um, got it in my shoulder. This one really, it doesn't really sit that well. This, this butt of this rifle doesn't really sit that well. It's basically for kids, I guess. But then again, I got this on my rib cage. Allow it to lay down right here, lay my cheek on top, bring it up. I mean, exactly, be I can bring it up with the, with the, with the. Um, I'm listening. I need you to look. I am looking. I, I, can, just, I, can, I can tell you this, but you're not, you got to see it. I can, I can raise and lower it like with this. I come up further, it raises, and don't know, it lowers. Gotcha. And, but I, it never leaves an anchor on my this case. My blood pressure is going to, my heart beat off. Same thing, right beside it. See, see that one right beside it? Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Where? It's right here. Oh. I was aiming for there, but it's right here. So that it's, I'm, I'm hitting it to the right. So I'm not. I'm not I think there's too much, um, too much of my finger in, in on that trigger. Okay. That's what I think it is. Try it now. Okay. Because when I when I when I got my when I hold my breath, I see my hands and shit. I mean, I, um, the target is, I mean, the, the rifle is moving with my heartbeat. <sighs> yeah, that's exactly. I know what's going on. Okay. I need a stand. Okay. And I can't see the crap either. This is crazy. I'm trying to keep it still and it won't be still because my heart beats. Well, I got closer. I got closer that time. I got to the bottom of it. Right there. So that's cool. Huh? Okay. I'm, I'm getting them two. And I haven't shot in like over oh, like a, a year, or six months. Two years. Not two years. Yeah. And I was out here shooting with y'all last year. Well, maybe the year before. So, you know, it takes some practice and things like that. It may not be the ideal environment because it's freezing. That's why I'm going to put it in the clavicle. And then this is going to be a rest. And then if you got it, you got to push your hips up like that. But it, it cannot be, you don't want it hanging out there like that. Yeah. Want it. You got to bring it up there, something like that. Yeah, right, right. It won't go on my wrist, my breath. And then, okay, that's fine. Um, and then, yeah, you, you see what I'm meant, I meant by the target. If you can do the seat tag, if I need to get a sharpie. No, I'm trying to get it between the little... This here? Yeah. Yeah. It's either a matter of left or right or up and down. Let's get it right between there. And, um... Like, you can go there? You bring it up and down. Yeah. And, uh... And then you, you really have to watch it. And your finger should relax. Your finger should just be like, you know... Like that, relax. Oh, let me see something. Let me see something. Okay. I made this your hand as short as mine, so that's 
I was looking at how you were holding it, like, okay. Kept the city off. <coughs> Kept the city off. This is forward. Get in my shoulder. Arm up in here. This takes it up and down. I gotta get it in between the string, and I can't see it. I can't, I can't, I can see that. Wait a minute, I'm trying to get my eye. I'm gonna mark where I shot, so we will know that we're not to get that mixed up. Next Did up. I, get the I don't know, sweetie. I'm marking where I shot at. See, there's a baby right there. Mm -hmm. This is where I shot at right here. It looks like there's a hole right there. Hole way over here? Yeah, there is a hole. Really? Yeah, that'll be, <laughs> that'll be you. That's the one I was aiming at. And that's because your eye. Yeah. Because you're you're using your left eye from your right side. Let me try it. Throwing it off that that far from the target. But if this was a dag on water buffalo, you would have hit it. Okay, a water buffalo. Okay, let's yeah. try it. Let me get rid of this because it might be. Wow, <laughs> I saw exactly what you did. She tore the side off this off, man. She, it's, it's over here. She hit way. Right. She hit way over here. You can see. I saw the debris pop off the side of this. So everything I just thought you. Oh my god! Turn your, turn, your, turn your body. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Turn my shoulder. Mm -hmm. Don't grab that thing. I know it feels weird. Does everybody do things from the right I side? Think it's hard. You just, you're targeting? Yeah. Faster? Faster? Mm -hmm. Now you just have to get your body used to this position. Your, your, your eye is left dominant. Now we're hitting shit. Okay. Where'd you hit? Um, Did I get it? I saw you hit something. Didn't this hit the whole right. right there? Yeah, that's it. That's the whole right there. I said, like I said, uh, you you take an inhale, then you release all the air out your breath and hold it, and then you squeeze gently. Off the side again. Off the side. I saw a ten off the side. Or maybe not. Maybe not, because uh, maybe that's from the back, because it's blowing out the back of it. There you go. Um, I saw that last time I was over here. Oh. I'm thinking it was this. Because <laughs> if you look, you can see clean through. You can see clean through that hole. Because I know it was far, it was so. I know I saw debris blowing out of here from this styrofoam.